welcome to another video king kobe here now in today's video i'm going to show you the other way to add your effects or the other way to add effects to your microphone now in my previous video i explained that you can use the mic fx part and you can also use the the master effects to apply your effects to your microphone today we are going to look at another way and that is the line in method right so just like a physical controller you know some controllers have mic slots that you can slot microphones in but then that means that if you want to apply effect yes definitely it is going to be applied to the master outputs right so if you want to apply effects just to that particular i mean to the microphone then it means that you have to slot the microphone into one of the channels so if you are fortunate and then you have four channels in your controller then you can use one channel for your microphone input so that is exactly what we are coming to do here right what it means is that you have to slot the microphone in one of the channels so if channel one and two is your most active used you can slot your microphone in what's channel three right and then you can have all the effects applied on there so in this experiment i am going to use my deck two to do that right so first of all what i need to do is go to my microphone my audio settings in virtual dj and what i will do is that i'll switch from microphone to line in right so i'll choose line in one okay like like this so no so let me choose line in two because i'm going to apply it to deck two right and then i'll apply now what i need to do is that i'll have to set a custom button so you know that this version of virtual dj doesn't come with a line in um, button on the interface so i have to set up a line in button here so now i can just click here and then okay and now the action is what line in so as you can see it comes here and then I'll set a button name also line in as simple as that and then I'll close it okay so after I've done this I don't have to even turn on the microphone you know if I you see that if I click on it it's not going to work so it defaults the microphone has to work all I need to do is to click on line in and then my microphone is working right so if I want to apply an effect to it I will just have to click on the effect that is that is on the interface here for this particular deck and then it is going to be applied so now i've applied the reverb effect and then i'm sure you can hear me right so i can even sorry i've reduced the volume so as i increase the volume it also records the mic just like that right so that is basically um, about it i can also increase the strength of the effect as well and you can see that my effect is applied if i turn on the effects the effect goes off and then if i click on the line in again and then the effect also goes off as well i mean the microphone is turned off as well right so you might as well want to try it in another deck i will have to save this here and then do that in another video on how to use the deck 3 and 4 because you know that if you switch to deck 4 i mean 4 decks you will not have the privilege of getting these buttons here the line in button so that you can set a button so what you can do is that you can set a keyboard mapping for for it right so i'll save that for another video but um do well to also subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't done that already and like and share this video to other virtual dj enthusiasts so i'll come here with another video but till then stay safe